What's up, my sweethearts? What it do? It's your girl, Jennifer M. Norellis. My sweethearts, I had to step away real fast. But I'm right back. But, yeah, my sweethearts, I see some emails. And I see y'all hit me up like, Jennifer M. Norellis. Um, I think Monifa had a baby. Have you seen it? Um, it's a girl and things like that. No, I don't stalk and I don't check that, my sweethearts. Because at this point, I already know what Monifa is a grimy friend, okay? But this is what I wanted to go off of right now. When y'all talk about the baby, you know what I'm saying? And y'all, um, I see a, a, I seen one email, my sweetheart, that said, Jennifer and the realest, she ain't even stopped. She's still partying and things like that. I'm not shocked. You know what I mean? I'm not shocked. So today, justice, my sweetheart's right. I want to go off of, piggyback off of that. It, it, there's another young girl, okay, that just wanted to go out and do what she wanted to do. So the babysitter returned her a dead infant. Basically, babysitter babysitter returned dead infant to the, her mom, disguised him to appear like he was sleeping. You hear this? So, I'm not shocked that when these girls get up and want to run and go party, seem like her. Want to run out there, go party, if you just had a new baby, drinking and partying. Things like this that I'm going to read to y'all will happen. Because they so young, dumb, and full of cum. Okay? My sweethearts, get your life to the way up. It don't even stop. A Wisconsin babysitter, okay, is facing a first-degree murder charge after authorities said that a two-month-old infant died of blunt force trauma while in her care and that, and that she then tried to hide the death by returning the boy to his mother wrapped in a snowsuit and strapped into a car seat with a hat pulled over his eyes, according to criminal complaint. You see this? According to a criminal complaint about the incident, it happened in October, my sweetheart, just when it was cold. The mother told authorities that she believed her son was sleeping and took him to a laundromat. First of all, when you get your child, if you care about your kid, from any babysitter, you're going to check and look at your child, right? You're going to kiss on your child, love your child, not be strapped up like you strapped down in a, a one of the dummies, you know, the uh, mannequins. No, or a doll baby. Uh-uh. So you grabbed your child from... The babysitter, and then took that baby straight to the laundromat? Uh-uh. With no noises or nothing, no movement or nothing getting made. Uh-uh. She discovered that he wasn't breathing, my sweethearts. And that he was cold to the touch when she tried removing him from the car seat. She began administrating CPR on the child while her sister called 911. According to the complaint. See, I don't even believe that. According to the complaint. That might have been correct. They don't believe that stuff. And I don't blame them. I don't blame them. My sweethearts. The babysitter Marissa Totsort was ordered on Friday to remain in police custody. Where she had been held since October, my sweethearts. It was unclear from the complaint whether Tot Sort has entered a plea to the charge, calls to the Marathon County District Attorney's Office, and to the State Public Defender's Office were not immediately returned. Numerous attempts to reach Tot Sort's, that's a crazy name, my sweetheart, relatives by phone. Everybody was unsuccessful. She need to be in there anyway. Authorities said that the mother dropped the child off 
at, at, I'm going to give you this crazy name again, Tot Sorts. That's a crazy name. Authority said that the mother dropped the child off at that crazy name home around 3.30 or 4 p.m., my sweethearts, on October the 18th, okay? According to the complaint, about two hours later, the mother received a text from Tot Sort in which she told the mother that she was listed in a local news outlet as having been charged with child abuse in an unrelated case. This is crazy. That crazy name I just gave y'all allegedly told the mother that as a result, she was not allowed to be in contact with children and asked the mother not to tell anyone she was caring for the woman's infant son. And another child. So as y'all hear. This crazy killer. With this crazy name. Was not even supposed to be around children. You heard this? Wasn't even supposed to be around kids. My sweethearts. Mm, mm, mm. She was listed in the local news outlet as having been charged with child abuse. So she just beats them. Because a two-month yo ain't no two-month child. Yo, baby, what they done? Cried. That's it, cried. The mother came to pick up the two children shortly after 9 p.m., according to the complaint. She thought the baby was sleeping as he would normally be sleeping at that time of the day. An investigator wrote in a complaint. You will think your child sleep if somebody called you and said, I'm, I'm wanted for abuse. I ain't supposed to be watching nobody kids because I have abuse charges. Okay, you miss me with that. That's why I keep blaming everything on parents. Ain't nothing wrong with them kids. It's the parents, 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 parents. I'm going to keep blaming them. Um, when she went to remove the baby from the car seat, his legs, his legs, my sweethearts, were rigid and remained bent at the knee. Like, you know, just sat there. Like, like basically, like, she just, she had to pull him. Like, he was so hard. He was laid there. That girl beat that baby while he was in that seat. I don't think she ever took him out the seat. Uh, uh, uh. Authorities tracked Tot Sword down at an area hotel at 4.15 a.m. where she allegedly told detectives that the child died in her care and that she didn't check for a pulse. She did not reach out for help and she did not perform any Oh, my God. <laughs> Resuscitation. Any resus... I can't say that word, my sweetheart. Yeah, my, my, my words. But you know what they saying. She didn't perform anything. CPR, any type of medical anything. It's called resuscitation. You know that. But it's hard for me to say that word. But she couldn't perform any of that on that baby. Are you serious, my sweethearts? I wish I could perf perform surgery on her and pull her apart. Because that's what she need. She don't make no sense. Doug walking her ain't enough. Top sort admitted that she put the baby's lifeless body on the floor in the hallway of her home, dressed him in the snowsuit, and then placed his body in the car seat with his blankets, according to the investigator's account, my sweethearts. When her boyfriend returned home around 6.30 p.m., Todd Sort did not tell him about the baby's death, but instead buckled the baby's car seat in her vehicle and drove with her boyfriend and her own son to a local McDonald's where they ate for 15 minutes, according to the complaint. And no one never noticed this baby not moving, not doing anything. 
not not crying, not being a regular normal baby. You hear me, my sweet horse? Let's get it. That's why I say like, it got to be idiots out here. Are you serious? Baby, not, mm, you know, moaning any type of movement. What? Kicking? The little babies always kick them little feet. Uh, miss me with this. Miss me. Lights is up all the way. It don't make no sense. When the mother came to pick up her son, Tatsor allegedly admitted she purposefully put a hat over the baby's eyes so that the mother would not realize her son was dead. You trifling somebody. A forensic pathologist who performed the autopsy determined that the child had died from three separate blunt force injuries to the head. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. A uh, 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 two-month? What? After she returned the lifeless baby to her mother, investigators allege in the complaint, Tot Swords went swimming in a hotel pool with her boyfriend and son. She is sick. But that get at you all go back to who you leave your kids with. So this Monifa going out to these parties, I mean to these other, you know, these parties, whatever she doing partying, leaving that baby off. Don't worry. This is a, this is the things that happen to these babies when these moms get out there and call themselves wanting a party. Oh, I can leave her. Sure can. What? I can leave her on him. You know, just any baby. You don't leave your baby with anybody but these young girls. Do because they need a babysitter so they can go out there and act the fool and have another one. What did she get to jail? You know how many mothers over there with they can't see them babies? Just wait. But then again, who left her with that baby? She even called the parent and told that parent. I cannot, I ain't supposed to watch babies. I'm a killer myself. That's basically what she said. She must felt the urge that hurt, hurt the baby. She must felt it. Or she must have thought the mother of that baby, the parent, her that. She said the local news was saying that she was abusive, you know, can't be around kids. She must have thought the parent must have seen that news. Mm, mm, mm. It don't make no sense. My sweethearts, so this was me trying to bring justice. So if no one know, you know, if I act a little extra... Someone need to act extra because from the looks of it, everyone acted dumb from this baby. It seemed like to me, everyone was acting dumb. No one was on point. Everyone was goofy. No one was expecting the baby to moan, cry, make a noise. Are you serious? I take them just for being dumb. That's why I keep the lights all the way up for trash like this. Y'all, the two-month-year-old baby have to be saying, rest in peace. Are you serious? You had a nerve to hit that baby three times in the head? What? So, like I said, my sweethearts, don't be shocked at, will she come back and see who, who, are, who, 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 who she had left, I'm sorry, my sweetheart, who she may have left that poor baby with, that poor newborn baby with. So don't be shocked. If y'all be doing a video about something that probably happened to that girl child because she want to pick drinking and partying over being a whole thousand percent parent. Not a hundred percent. It take more than a hundred percent to be a parent. A thousand. 
It's a lot with you children. So my sweet hearts, it's your girl Jennifer I'm the realest. Like always bringing this justice. <laughs> it disgusts me. I'm here, Dave. It's other things I really, I just want to just duh, walk and go straight in on her. Straight in. And I don't even want to go in on the babysitter. The babysitter ain't knock for the mom. The babysitter disgusting monster. As y'all can see. It's all on her track record. Make no sense. Disguised. A dead baby. As being alive. How more sick could you be? And y'all want me to take it easy on somebody? Or not be extra? I wish I would. I wish this girl over here, Jennifer the Realist, would not be extra. Not be on somebody's tail feather or take it easy. I wish I would. It's your girl, Jennifer the Realist. Please like, share, subscribe. Hit that bell to be notified. Chime in my sweetheart with your girl. Where's my, my sweetheart at? Because I know this like really like. Especially any sweethearts that had left their kids with any babysitter recently. Where y'all at with y'all with y'all words of some encouragement to these young ones? You know what I mean? Or to anybody that be this dumb. Get your likes all the way up, my sweethearts. Your girl and I'm out.